It's been a fairly confident start from Southampton, as you'd expect. They've dominated much of the ball. Here's Diallo. Long has done well to hold off Pennington there. This is Caleb Watts, the debut on. He slipped it through to Vokins, and it needed the touch over from the goalkeeper. Matthias Sharkic called into action for the first time. It was a good turn from Long and an excellent piece of play from the 19-year-old Australian. Here's Ward Press. Already starting to dominate things in midfield. Southampton, as you can see, with Stevens well forward, squeezing play. Ward Prowse looks up and it's Watts that has made the run. It's off his shoulder. It's Ndulu who turns and finds the corner. On his FA Cup debut, a first senior goal for Dan Ndulu. Southampton have the lead and it's a searching pass from the captain which has done it again. Watts played his part and it's an accurate finish. The striker charged with doing the damage in place of Che Adams, and he's done it. Shrewsbury corner, their first of the game so far. It's a little too deep, it's long, the shortest man on the field that gets it away. Wally Norburn, the captain. Vela has found Wally, who stayed up from the corner and cues one. The offside flag is up anyway, it wouldn't have counted. Fraser Forster clawed it away. And looks like Ebanks Landell is the slowest to come back out. Sean Wally not able to add to his five goals so far. Diallo has been given away. That's a rarity for Southampton at the moment. They've been composed, and here's Norbert, who's moved it on quickly. Chapman, well, the cross has hit Stevens, and Forster makes sure it goes behind. He has been one of their livelier players, Harry Chapman. The debut on loan from Blackburn. Norburn quickly fed it out to him. And it was a good early ball, which very nearly crept in. Bednare. Again, Ward Prowse dictating things long. Found by Vokins. It's good interplay this between the left back and Shane Long. And a good cross too, which is pushed away by Sharkic before it can reach anyone dangerous. Another example of the 20-year-old's interplay and his awareness. Will press, flick to Stevens and pushed away by Sharkic. Well, finally, from their multitude of set pieces, Southampton have created a decent opportunity. And it was very nearly turned in by Jack Stevens for a first goal of the season. Southampton have had plenty of it here. Shrewsbury have been happy to keep them at arm's length, Bednarek, Stevens, and Ward Prowse. Now he weighs it up again. That diagonal to Vokins has paid off. Vokins faced by Williams, and it's side footed and cleared off the line by Piet. And again, Southampton come close. Again, it wouldn't quite go in. It's Watts who nearly makes it, and look how tight it is. Near post this time with Long flicking it. And Shane Long still searching for that elusive goal. February last year, the last time he found the back of the net against Aston Villa, and it isn't to be. Diallo, the Frenchman, has had an excellent game, slotting in comfortably alongside Ward Prowse. And here's Che Adams, who's onside and round the goalkeeper. Can he finish? No, he can't. It's Pierre in the way again, and no way through either for Southampton on the follow-up. Excellent timing of the pass and the run. He did all the hard work, but couldn't follow up, and neither could Alexander Jankovic. Ward Press in the last moments of the game to finish it, and he has. Another set piece from James Ward Press, and the captain sees Southampton safely through to round four. They'll host Arsenal coming up. It's Southampton 2, Shrewsbury Town 0, no giant killing here.